Hey, well, it's uh, my pleasure to share with you the online HTML version of my new book, Causal Inference to Mixtape. Uh, let me share with you the um, screens. So I'm gonna share this real quick. All right, so you're gonna go to my website and uh, you're gonna see here this thing. I gotta kind of get this worked up a little bit more. Then you got all the same stuff as before. You got this big banner here. Nice, but then you go over here to causal inference to mixtape and boom, different, you're in the matrix. Now you're, uh, you know, everything's, uh, you know, you're in the matrix, you've got all the, you know, you've downloaded all the powers and everything. And so uh, here you are. So what you have here is 11 uh, chapters, uh, the welcome page. You've got links on every page to where you can buy the book. You've got the introduction and you got, look what you got here. You, of course you got DAGs, yeah, you knew that was coming, but um, look at this, do stuff, our stuff, right? You can, can't, well, you can't type in this, right? But you can copy it. Well, that's not all you can do. For a limited time of forever, there is a teaching resources page. And on the teaching resources page, you can see how to, um, you can see how to uh, um, basically use that R code interactively in your class. And I'm gonna provide you here with a, with a YouTube that you can watch and it'll tell you um, how to use uh, the, the options that I've made available um, to you through my R Markdown, the options I've had for you to actually study the R code that will allow you to run the simulations or the analysis or to implement the estimators in different kinds of scenarios. So I hope that the book is helpful. Um, if you find issues with the book, uh, I'll, I'll post a thing how you can, you know, store those issues at GitHub so that, you know, I can go through and create an erratum uh, document that will sort of show where all the corrections are. First time through, you know, I think that uh, even though this book was read about 10 billion times, there's still things that should have been said a little differently or the grammar was bad. So um, uh, look at it. I hope you can find it helpful. Thank you.